pathology is the study of disease. My particular interest is uh, the liver, or hepatopathology as we call it. You may think pathology is an odd job. It's not really, but it is a bit strange cutting up dead people, looking at uh, lumps and bumps under the microscope. Uh, but it brings me back, the pleasure I get is personally teaching, and these students, they're not odd, but they are odd. They do some extraordinary things. I've got amazing sort of students. I love teaching medical students, that's one of my other jobs. I'm a professor here, and at the moment I'm marking medical student papers, and they're just so clever, most of these students, they're just so bright. Here's my last research student, Hamish Jamison, who spent a year working on the liver, and looking at the liver in diabetes. Well, now we're off to the museum where uh, I keep wonderful specimens from people who've donated them to show to our students so they can see every sort of disease in the world, or not quite, but all of them. Here we are at the museum. It's, it's our library. Uh, all these organs have been donated by people and their relatives to help teach the medical students. As a library, there are the hearts, there are the brains, guts right down the end there, spleens and kidneys there, and my favourite organ, the liver over there. Here are the livers, uh, cirrhosis and fatty liver, and oh, here's a really fascinating one. Look at this blue liver. It's blue because it's full of iron. If you look at that bit, it's rusty. The reason it's full of iron is because some men can't stop absorbing the iron and their bodies fill up with, with, with iron. It causes cirrhosis of the liver. It also rings the bells when these people go through uh, the uh, place at the airport, uh, the bells, the, the metal detector at the airport. They just walk through naked and they still ring the bell. Oh, let me show my, you my research. It's just fantastic, the thing I love. It's a liver sieve. We named it that. That's a sieve, of course, from a, uh, from a sink. And the extraordinary thing is the blood vessels through the liver are exactly the same. Here's a small blood vessel, myriad of little holes. These little holes clear the fat of blood. And here's the, fat, the blood fat from the diet. Little ones, cholesterol. Bigger ones have got fat vitamins in them. And if those holes disappear, as they have here from a person who's been drinking, drinking and drinking for 12 years, then the fat is cleared from the blood. The person gets milky, milky blood, and the liver lo loses its vitamins, so the liver goes scarred. You may think pathology is an odd job, but I've found it most enjoyable. I've got a bit fanatical about the liver, because that's my research. And even the car, for example, I've called it liver. Nice number plate. My wife sort of got shocked. People ask me, is it a butcher? I say, no, it's a pathologist, a good name liver. I also tell them I'm a research interest is the liver. That's, that's my odd job.